Hey guys, Gamer Gregor here, and this is just a quick pickups video. Uh, trying to show you guys what I picked up over the last oh, week or so, I guess. So, I'll start off with what I got for the Sega Genesis. And some of, some of these have some little bit of label damage, and um, I got them for cheaper that way. They're mostly just stuff that I wanted to play more than just, you know, collect, so to speak. Um, the first one is Toy Story. Pretty uh, fun little game. And here's one of the ones with label damage, and that's a um, Street Fighter II Special Champion Edition, which I don't know if there's anything special about the Special Edition, so to speak, but uh, I wanted a copy of Street Fighter 2, and the last one for the Sega Genesis is Sonic and Knuckles, and this one's really weird. It kind of it opens up, and I guess the way it works is that you can put Sonic 2 or Sonic 3, both of them, in here, and then it makes this an expansion pack, or you can just play the game as its own standalone game too. And this seems to be the not for resale copy so it must have been a pack in with something next for the nintendo sixty four i got rocket robot on wheels from value village that was a pretty good deal and then i got micro machines sixty four turbo which i've never played micro machines on the nintendo sixty four but i have played um, Micro Machines on the PlayStation 2, so um, that was really fun. So when I saw that, I I kind of I thought I'd better pick it up because this this place we have it's kind of a dedicated game store. Um, they're clearing out a lot of their stuff for like N N64 and also um, NES. Uh, so the next thing. Let's see, I got some PlayStation 2 stuff here. And this one came from a place called Hastings. It's kind of a local chain, I guess. But it's uh, Gungrave Overdose. And it was really cheap. But it's actually, I have an another copy of that, but it was so cheap I couldn't pass it up. Um, at Value Village, I got... Episode 3, Star Wars, Revenge of the Sith, for the PlayStation 2. And at a newer gaming store that just opened up, I got Dot Hack Infection. So I'm always on the lookout for these games, and uh, this is a good addition to my collection. So Then again from Value Village... Um, for the Xbox, I got Prince of Persia, The Two Thrones. And this one's got a bit of a marked up case and the manual's missing, but uh, I just wanted it because it's a fun game. And that's Super Monkey Ball 2. Then, for the NES, this one's got a messed up label too, but I got it for like a dollar, I think. It's Tickle Cubicle, which uh, is a game I played when I was a little kid. So I'm excited to get my hands back on that. And I also got um, Mario Bros. Duck Hunt Track Meet, which is, I guess that's the one of the other packing games. There was, there was Mario Bros. Duck Hunt, and there was uh, Gyromite, and there was, um, I guess that was the other one with the extra game on there. I'm not sure when they did that exactly. And the biggest deal here, and I got this all in a bundle, but I got a new system. And I don't I'm going to have to pick up a power cord so I don't know if it works yet, but even even if it doesn't all the peripherals and stuff that came with it make it made it worth the, you know, the 20 bucks or whatever I put I spent on it. And that is the 
Nintendo Entertainment System. The front loader, obviously. And that came with... And you'll see why I was saying that it was worth it, even if the system doesn't end up working. Three controllers. RF cord, I'm not going to use that though. Two zappers. And an NES advantage. So that's not bad. But I'll have to see how everything goes once I hook it all up. So anyways, that's my quick little pickups video. And uh, hopefully I'll do more of these soon.